my god, look at those clouds. I hope they go away and that sun pops out. Look at this view. Oh, hey folks, how y'all doing? Y'all doing alright? Check out this view. Whoa. There we go. Look there. Got the parking lot and the stores down there. Got a silo there. A little hay barn looks like. Got the BGA plant over there. Some fields. Look at those trees. Oh my. Whoa. Whoa. I'm back to the earth. Alright folks. Welcome to Corn Belt. Farming Simulator 17 here on Mr. Blue Farms. Folks, I'm about to get mad my controller. It keeps on wanting to go in circles. Well, anyway, here we are on a new map. Well, I don't know how new it is, but it's new to me. So, yeah. Um, I ran across two more maps besides the West Coast and plain and simple. This is, uh, I forgot the language, but it starts out in a different language, which says, Welcome to Corn Belt. So, we're just going to call it Corn Belt. But, you start off in the house here in town. And, uh, yeah. But it's not too far into town, I guess. It's, oh, can't pull it. I can't do this. Well, I didn't want to show it that big. But, you can see, we're kind of on the edge of a small town here. Surrounded by fields. And that's the bigger map, folks. We're kind of in the top. Northeast corner there. We start out with three fields. We got uh, 49, 50, and then you go on down kind of center of the map. We got field 35. So yeah, our our main area is pretty much at the biogas plant right there, north of field 35. And uh, yeah, so let's get to it. First of all, we're gonna go I think right over here. See there? Yeah, I, I, I installed everything I think I need. I uh, still need to install a little bit more, but I'm working on it because one of the mods conflicts with the the map. It, it's, it freezes it right off. So, as soon as you hop in a vehicle, it freezes. But if I'm not mistaken, uh, what is this? Or sheep and chicken area? Where it looks, we got a silo here, some parking spaces there, uh, fuel tanks here that we can get fuel. Yeah, I hear chickens out here somewhere. Right there they are. Let's see what this says. Sheep farm. Small sheep farm. Small. Okay. It is small, folks. Feeding trial. Water trough where it looks. Uh, pretty much it. I don't know where the uh, wool will spawn, but we'll probably find out pretty soon. Uh, let's just go ahead and jump in our first vehicle, which is a train. Go figure. Folks, it's down at the bottom, what would be the southwest corner. It's uh, Satin's Sawmill, I think is how you say it. Um, you got two trains down here. Um, this is not the BGA plant. It's like a, uh, one's a fertilizer, other's a seeds. And it's like some kind of a storage facility, I think, there. Not quite for sure. Uh, jump in our next vehicle, which is a train. And this one is at our main farm by the biogas plant. As you can see, uh, let's zoom out right here. Can't see it from here, but that's our farm shop area right there. And way back here in the back, you can see those two things sticking up. That's the BTA plant over there. Our third train very top left corner 
the uh, northwest corner and we just have a storage facility right here because look how many fields you got you got one two three all the way up to eight fields right here that's a, a big area so look out across here you don't see nothing but farmland <coughs> excuse me folks so yeah that's uh pretty much is how you get your grain back to where you want it or you just store it here and transfer it by truck but it will be a very long drive uh, I'm thinking this is this crude oil only uh, somewhere somehow you got oil plants here and there and uh, you got a uh, bring the oil in from a tanker up to here somewhere fill these tanks up or fill this train up I think bring it here something like that but the extra rail cars there you can't hook to I don't have no way of transferring to that track so yeah so our next vehicle please don't tell me the game just froze Yep, this is what it does, folks. This is what it does. It's like this right here. I, I can't do nothing except my tri bumper triggers. And, uh, yeah, I didn't hear me hitting all the buttons. So I'm going to have to restart it because um, I put too many mods in. Okay, so it was one of those mods I just put in. Okay, I will be right all right just to let y'all know what it looks like right here this is the language right here but translated to English this is welcome to corn belt and I'm restarting for the fourth time now all right as you can see course place it course plate is loading to the right right there you got the farming tablet notification see factory overview so yeah uh, before I even get started switching through all this we're going to go to garage and uh, this is what we have folks in our garage we got two of the magnums quad track we have two of the challengers um, this one being brand new, and it's just one tenth an hour. We have two semi trucks. We have three of uh, the CR 1090s, three headers, but we do not have no corn headers. We do not have no corn on this map. We got two of the Joskins, two of the Chromes. Um, they're just trailers, they're not loader wagons or anything, so. Uh, we do have two of these trailers, 59,000 are the in-game trailers, not the modded ones like I got. Three of the Condor planters, two fertilized buggies, two auger wagons, and that's it. Alright, sorry about that folks. Get back. Where was that? Um... I took that truck out, just, just making sure it wasn't in there. We'll try it one time to cycle through these trains. And still nothing. Alright, take seven. Let's see if that works this time. I have just maybe one or two extra mods besides what come with the uh, download package. As you can see, I got into the truck this time. We got this truck, the Twin Star, and then, folks, look, we got three big tractors here. Oh my god. Three of the 1090s. Look at this big old shed we got put up in. Having through the other tractor. I don't know why they threw a, a case in there, but 
kind of glad they did. And here's the one one of the magnums. And I'm gonna I'm gonna get out from right here and show y'all the trailers. We got twins there, and we got twins there. And come out here and we got more twins. This is a twin farm, I guess. As you can see. But this, like I said, this is corn belt and those are grain tanks I was showing you ago. Um, <coughs> Alright, there you go. You can see that. Uh, yeah, okay, I do have my speed. My speed is one of the things I installed. I really don't know how many more minutes I got left in my time, so I might go a little over, folks. But as you can see, I'm going to get my feet in there because I might chop them off in this grinder. But top is a different language and bottom. It says root crops, potatoes, and sugar beets. And over here in this end, you got ripe soybeans and sunflowers. And then wheat, barley, and corn. And this makes our pig food. Same thing over here is straw, grass, and silage makes our cow food. Our power, power food for the cows. And, um, oh, now I see where the shoots are at. Okay. No, no, no. This wrong, wrong build. This part, it, it's a power food and pig food, but I was thinking about the sugar beets and potatoes. They're in a different build. <clears throat> Excuse me. Silage bins or chaff bins. That's where your cows are at. Um, trying to think. I think it's back over this way. Uh, yeah. This building right here, folks. These go in. Um, yeah, it's in a different language. But anyway, you can see right up there, which I can't really make out. It looks like it says potatoes there, and it's sugar beets over here on this side. Yeah. So, big old storage place for them. And I'm just going to lift myself up. Here's a, one of the silos here. I really don't know what this one takes. Probably the uh, sugar beets and stuff. I'm not for sure. But this is one of the BGA plants here. Got some parking places over here. Digest eight. Uh, chaff and stuff. And you take this and you take it way off. And you make some uh, fertilizer and seeds way off somewhere. So, yeah. Yeah, empty lot right here where you can put some stuff. Don't know if the water tower works for water or not, but we'll find out pretty soon. Uh, cow area. Storage. But the manure there. And is this the more? Yeah, right over here. Yeah, big old pit right there for the. This is the cow area. This might do be the pigs. I'm I'm not for sure. I'm thinking this might be the pigs, folks. And whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, get over here, go this way. I think this is the cow area here because the way this building looks. And uh, you got the manure pit there, and then you got the slurry pit right there, I believe, for both pigs and cows. And then all this storage room for this equipment. Um, okay, I'll fall back to earth here. 
we're gonna get back in this tractor so I can go to this tractor. <coughs> now we'll explain my call up here in a minute. Oh, so excuse me. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and explain it. Of course, you know I've been per out almost two weeks of making videos. Well, I've got sick within that time. A couple of fires went to. It's been raining here. So yeah, I just uh, plus they harvest the cotton field by my house, and that's really put the damper on my sinuses along with the, the I guess the humidity or whatever, you know, the dampness of the weather, and it just <clears throat> I got a tickle in my throat and I can't get it out. So yeah, that explains my cough, and I probably will be making a a video. It's when I can right now, folks. So. But anyway, I want to show you this field. As you can see, the big map here. I'm going to stand at field 34. Before I show you the price. You can see right here. I've already done a mission or two on these. But you can see right here on the map. You know, in, in the field. It goes that way, but yet the planting part goes this way. So what's up with that? Well, this is the mission field here. They plowed in this to go all the way up around the main farm and back around, which is good. It gives you more field, but if you do a mission, you better go straight instead of curving. <coughs> Excuse me again. And show you the price of this. Two million three hundred forty-four thousand two hundred eighty-one folks for this field. I want this field, but I can't do that. I cannot afford that. And here's field thirty-three, which I wish we had it because we do not have no crops right now whatsoever. We have to plow, plant, fertilize, all that good stuff. Um, this one here I did not do a mission on. But it's four million for this one. I want to say four point one. So yeah. And I got the tractor parked in the way, but yeah, folks. <coughs> <coughs> Go to the map here, show you all this. That's what all your fields look like. Take a gander. Yeah, sip on water, keep my throat wet. But as you can see right here, field 35 is ours. Okay, and it's you got this mission field here. All right. Well, you see this one right here is mission for 32. Okay, check that out. Okay, some of these missions you can't do. Say, for example, which one was it I was going to do? It might have been this one. We say, for example, this one right here. Field 9. See how it's shaped? And here's the mission thing for it right there. See, Field 9 right there. By the time you get your equipment right here and then get over here you're out of time and you can't do that mission okay I don't think it's going to count against me but yeah see how far it is away from see right here is where the mission starts and that's where your equipment spawns this to show you all right we're gonna start check this out return the field okay come on come on there's no way see mission failed so some of these missions you cannot do Again, sorry. 
the show you want to have been doing is well was it this one this one's going to take a while this is one I need to be done it's right there beside ours there like I said I want to start with these right here I want to get 34 since we own 35 or maybe get 33 here but we're going to, have to come up with a lot of money folks by that time but just let's, let's go to right here fill 60 you see how close these are Okay. Look how much they want for it. We'll get the time. Time ain't too bad on this for this. We'll get 13,000. I'm just going to have to do a lot of missions. So, yeah. Let's see, let's see if we can go ahead and do this. That way I can talk to y'all a little bit. Go ahead and get my weight here. Go ahead and get turned around. Shouldn't take too long to do this, and hopefully. Well, I got 12 plus 8 is 20. That might be a little long episode here. Maybe, maybe not. I like the sound of the GPS now. Get that off of there. Well, I hope this whole field was part of the mission because uh, that's another thing. If you uh, don't pay attention, like field 30, 34 was, it wasn't all this field. There was this cross here down this area. So yeah, but this field goes all the way up in here. That's one reason why I was wanting to work it out. I might do that off screen. Work on these two off screen. So that'd be a nice little lump. Now we do have some grass areas up here we can mow. That way we can start getting our grass and silage built up for getting some cows and sheep. So yeah. As you can see in the top left up there, that is called the Glant Grants. Uh, can't say it. Glance mod. And you just you know look up there and you can see what's doing what. Kind of like the inspector mod. Sure, turn it so look at look at that grassy area right there. So it's a good spot where we mow. You know, it's kind of close to our area, so I'm just gonna be very picky with the mods I install. Uh, like I said, we do not have no plows, so I'm going to have to buy some plows. Uh, think about taking the two challengers buying two plows for them and that should do it and then uh, hook the magnums up to the fertilized buggies so I have to buy some fertilized so I need a lot of money folks I need a lot of money anyway <clears throat> I figure out how to make this episode here I ain't gonna go too much more but just want to let y'all know I found this map I kind of like it it's gonna get some time to get used to it because it's so big um, we did have a thing the tablet mod that appeared on the right there I gotta figure out how to open it 
and also we have uh, crude oil. I have to I have to get a trailer and a semi, and you go to these oil pumps, and like I said, you, I think I said it earlier, you, you fill up the crude oil, you take it to this factory, and you get money off of that. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to do that too. But I got this mount. West Coast, plain and simple, and I also got another one. Hang on, just a second, folks. Also found another map it was Western Australia. I don't know if I got a bad uh, mod of it or, or whatever, uh, but the one I downloaded the chicken, sheep, and cows icons was out in the center of the fields. Well, not all of them are center, it's just out in the fields. And when I went to them, they wasn't there. So I went all over the map, could not find no cows or sheep nowhere. And it was 16 big fields uh, where the market shop was supposed to be at. There was not one. Couldn't find a market shop. So I bought a tractor. The tractor I bought ended up out in the field. Okay, so I reset it and it reset the same spot. So I think I got a bad map of it because I seen other people play it. That seems pretty nice. But I don't know. I'm going to have to go back and watch their videos. Uh, see who it was to go from there. But other than that, uh, Western Australia is off the list. But I know y'all probably want to see some new maps and stuff. So I got the West Coast, Plains and Simple, and this in here. Uh, auto save scares me every time, folks. But this in here um, is big. It's a 16x map, and plain and simple is a I'm pretty sure a 16x map too. So big maps, folks, for one person. Now on um, plain and simple, I got a lot of mods, a lot of mods in there. I'm gonna have to get it narrowed down. Uh, Pleasant Valley 17v3 I added a few more mods to it. Uh, I did have uh, uh, What is it called? It limited so I can put it on Dropbox But I do have some bad news about Dropbox uh, Apparently that storage space I had was limited. I had like 27 gigabytes of space but I got an email uh, a couple of days ago saying that it will expire pretty soon and I will only have two gigabytes two folks two gigabytes of space in my Dropbox I gotta have at least 10 to 11 gigabytes for my mods so don't know what I'm gonna do there I'm going to find some way of putting them up so I can share them with y'all. Because I want to start playing with people. Uh, big shout out to my brother, friend, vlogger, and everything else. Uh, Colin and Julian Vlogs. Thank you, brother, for the shout out of the day. Uh, Try to make up for all the shout out wars I've been missing. And also, AG Baby Girl Val. Thank you for that shout out, girl. It helps so much. Got 15 subscribers off you. 15 more family members because of that shout out. Thank you so much, girl. Appreciate it. A big shout out to your kids uh, and buddy and boyfriend, husband, whatever he is to you. Big shout out to all y'all. Uh, 
your live streams and stuff they're really fun to watch and folks if you haven't seen them yet go check her out awesome lady awesome kids and uh, what is it frozen olive frozen or olive off of frozen I'm not good with my movies folks I don't even really watch movies y'all know that I spend a lot, all my time on YouTube watching all the videos and stuff the only really TV time I watch is Sunday nights when The Walking Dead comes on that's my favorite show right there that's more fun. That that show and my internet is or uh, you know only reason I really have cable and internet. And speaking of internet, my bill went up again. Another three dollars for surcharges. <sighs> yeah, I just don't know, folks. It's getting where it's not worth it, you know. I got the 50 megs down and 10 megs up or something like that, whatever they're called. So, I don't know. They keep going like that, they can have it. I'll just go back to the basics. Almost done, folks, but I am really. See, 22 minutes, eight. that's about 30, about 30 minutes in. I wouldn't go just a little bit longer. Y'all ain't had an hour episode in a while, so. <clears throat> a big shout out to Yankees Outdoor Adventures. Greg Carter Outdoors. Um, bunch of other folks, bunch of others. They're all down below in the description. Make sure you go check them out. Random Nation, Bam Bam, Bam Bam Girl Amy, and uh, trying to think of them off my head. I, I, I need to get my, I got a, a brand new printer sitting over here, but I cannot find a CD to it for the drivers to save my life. I done tried Googling it, trying to get some drivers off the internet, can't do that, so... I don't know what to do about the printer. Uh, uh, in other words, you know, I can take that printer, uh, word pad, put all, everybody's name on a word pad, print them out, and I'll have them right here in front of me. <coughs> but anyway, yeah. Just don't be lazy, folks. Go down below in the description. Check everybody out. Show them some love. Uh, especially my brother, Colin. Uh, he's been there for me ever since we we pretty much started together. I can't remember who started first, but he's been doing daily vlogs every day. Yo, gotta give him some love for that, folks. Daily vlog every day. Um, sorry, folks. I. Felt like I had to sneeze. I was trying to hold it in. All right, we're three quarters of the way here. We're gonna get this mission done. Then we're gonna call it an episode. Uh, next time we come in, probably gonna have some clowns. <coughs> Excuse me again. I got a tickle on the left side of my throat, and. Folks, please, no funny comments now. And speaking of comments, I want to thank each and every one of y'all that has left a comment. Y'all been wonderful. And I hate to say this, but all y'all that's been commenting bad stuff, good luck trying to get through. And, uh, if you don't stop, I'm gonna turn you over to my friend Bo. He'll he'll chew you up and spit you out, folks. I'm, I'm just kidding. But come on now, folks. 
you know, for one, I'm a guy, and I'm not gay, and I do not appreciate any <coughs> any kind of pics coming through on my comments. Though they will not get through because y'all are blocked automatically. And the other ones that's trying to sell me sub for sub. Now I ain't talking about comment sub for sub. I'm talking about actually trying to sell me subs. Come on now. Twenty dollars for a hundred subs? Or nineteen ninety nine for a thousand views. I'll get my own. Thank you very much. Go on to somebody else. I never thought I'd see a day I get a a comment. Hey, you got a great channel. I left you a big like and sub to your channel. Can you come buy some views from me? That's all right. I'll get my own views. You can sell views all day long, but you can't get that watch cut time to sell, can you, folks? Huh? But anyway, folks, that's enough of that. You know, everybody gets them. <coughs> it just it makes it kind of rough. For the ones that does actually go to spam folder, that doesn't need me there. Which I'm glad YouTube come up with that one little check mark box, you know. Uh, approved co uh, comments from this user is approved or something like that. I can't remember what it says, but I'm glad they put it down there. You know, people like uh, AG Baby Girl, J Metal, Bo, when they comment and stuff, it, it you can hit that check. Here we go. But you can hit that check mark, and their comments will always be approved. Uh, I like that feature. But check this out, folks. 13,512 time bonus 5,275. So that's uh, 18. Almost 19,000 right there. Brings us 113,000. All right. Cool. Let's see what we got here. No missions, but. Hey, we got it. Oh, we got about 40,000. A little 40,000 bring him down to $1 million. It won't take very long. You'll see, there's enough 15,000. Probably about 20,000 right there. If I can get some harvest missions, those big ones, I'm going to try some of them. Get us some big money up there. I don't think it take long to get those fields. But let's go to the store real quick. <clears throat> oh, I'm so sorry, folks. My nose is just all chipped. Mm. Stopped up. I want to show you. I'm probably going to go ahead and get one. Now, this is a good one. But this in here. So that is 10 meters. This one is 26 meters. My favorite one is 15. Um, I just don't know. It's cheaper. Heck, I don't even have enough to get that right there. I like to get two of those. That'd be 240,000. Wow. We're just going to have to stick with this one right here. 90, 95,000. I'm going to go ahead and get it. That way we'll get some other stuff too. Okay. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Okay, the plows, we only got three fields, okay? Let's back up. 15 and 26, that's a big difference, folks. I forgot. Let's lease these guys, okay? There you go. There's one. And there's two. And we got 93,000. Well, that makes more sense right there. All right. We got the fertilizer spreader, so I ain't worried about a spreader right now. But later, 
we're going to get our famous one right here. We're going to buy him. Okay. We might buy two of them. Never know. Um. Oh, Lord. I don't forgot my thoughts. Let's see here. I want to lease another tractor. Just because I can. This one right here. 1,000 viral challenger. All it is is flint raw plus cat challenger skin on it. I do not want the front loader yet. But I do want the big motor. I'm going to keep it that color. We're going to start out with... Uh, Let's go with twin wheels all the way around. Let's lease that. There we go. All right, we got 62,000. Oh, wow. Look here. There we go. Let's check out in the side. Look at there, folks. Oh, yeah. We got a sunroof. Can we open that sunroof? Oh, look at that, we can. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Let's see what else we got right here. Oh, look at that. Oh, we got the spinner, huh? All right. Well, I want flaps on. Let's see here. Oh yeah, we got all these other. And I gotta take that off to turn. We got one more right here. Oh yeah, we have all them on there. I like it. I like it. It's gonna be like our main tractor. I'm probably gonna go ahead and buy this tractor. Um, we got some good lights on it, good beacons. It's gonna be probably our transport tractor mainly it's not going to pull these big things but he is probably going to transfer them to the farm uh, folks I am out of time I don't want to make this too much longer um, I got to get a semi and a flatbed well I got the semi I just need to get a flatbed and get some fertilizers Oh Lord. Uh, gotta get all that back to the farm. But I'm gonna take these two tractors. And one thing we'll probably do, but it's a maintenance shop up here. Since we got this area right here. Well, we might put it somewhere over in here. Well, we need to put some uh, duels on these guys right here. That way it won't run our fields up too bad. So, uh, probably do that next time we come in. And, uh, yeah, we'll get to plow on those fields. I'll get everything uh, situated here, folks. And, uh, looks like a good spot right there to put that field. Yeah, looks like a good spot. Let's check it out real quick. Show you what I'm talking about. It's under replaceables. Vehicle workshop 28,000. Might well go ahead and uh, deploy this thing. Uh, let's see here. Let me go around this side. Put that baby about right. There. There we go. There we go, folks. Or you can pull up here, change your tires and stuff. Of course, it's going to cost a little money. Of course, I'm going to have to do some, a couple more missions, like I said, off screen. Uh, 
Did I get it? Oh yeah, there we go. Say customize. Uh, five, six, seven. So that's the biggest motor we got in it. So uh, let's go. Let's go with triple wheels. Let's do it, folks. Triple wheels. Let's, let's see what they look like. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, folks. Next time, folks, you're going to see more of this. All right. I got to go. Thank each and every one of y'all for commenting. Love each and every one of y'all. And I will see y'all next time. Uh, don't know why I'm going to post another one. Um, still a little tied up for time right now. Not quite rested all the way, but I'm getting back, folks. So maybe every other day, something, somewhere on there. Uh, 2 p.m. Central Time. And, uh, folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later. Bye.